you can do that. Well, you this is not only a chance to marvel at local talent. I'm so excited to tell you about an upcoming art fair in Birmingham. You're going to be able to check out beautiful local talent just like this behind me, but this is also a chance to support a really important local cause. It's a great cause right in our own community. Here now to tell us about Common Ground's Birmingham Street Art Fair, which is coming up next weekend, is Jeff Kapazinski with Common Ground and also Kim Roney. She's a participating artist. So thank you so much for joining us. We really appreciate it. Well, thank you for having us. So, and it's great to have you here in the studio as well. Kim, your beautiful art. So Jeff, I'm gonna start with you. Tell us about the art fair coming up next weekend. It's the 17th and 18th. What can people expect? How many artists will be there? You know, this is the 48th year for the event. Uh, Common Ground last year celebrated its 50th anniversary. This art fair has been around almost just as long. Uh, the event is held in Shane Park. Uh, it used to be called Art in the Park. Uh, we'll have over 100 artists wow. uh, this year, and uh, which is exciting because we did have some off years during the pandemic. Sure. And things have things have started to come back. So you'll see artists of all different specialties uh, from lovely uh, paintings and, and, and uh, glasswork, jewelry, um, wood carvings. There's a lot of different things to, uh, to take part of. And I know that September is also Suicide Awareness Prevention Month, and that's where Common Ground comes in. So talk to us a little bit about your organization. Thank you. Common Ground is a crisis response agency uh, focusing primarily on mental health and substance use. Uh, we are, as I said, been around for 50 years. Most people probably know us through the R1-800 number that they can call anytime, 24-7. Uh, we have a new program that we're launching that we just launched this year called Behavioral Health Urgent Care. Uh, it's really intended to give access to more people uh, who need uh, interventions. Uh, they're dealing with anxiety or depression, things like that. Uh, and they can access that program through our website. It's actually virtual right now. So uh, by logging in, uh, signing into the program, they can be connected with a mental health specialist in under a minute. And going to the fair, will some of those proceeds benefit Common Ground? That's exactly the plan this year. Yeah, we, we host a uh, silent auction every year, and that's where the proceeds from that event will, will go this year is to the uh, urgent care. That's great. Now I want to talk about some of this beautiful work that we see here. Kim Roney, thanks yeah. so much for being here. You are My one pleasure. of the many artists that is going to be participating next yeah. weekend at the fair. Talk to us about your work, your inspiration, and kind of how you work as an artist. Okay. Well, I'm, um, I'm a, um, a real a farm girl. Grew up on a farm in um, Milan, Michigan, just south of Ann Arbor. And so, and I'm a gardener and a lover of all things outdoors. So a lot of my work is inspired by things I see that your are- your garden here. Yeah, yeah, my garden and I'm always picking things and, and putting things together to paint from. Um, it's very, uh, south of Ann Arbor, it's pretty flat. I have a lot of wide open agricultural vistas and meadows. And so that influences my work. And then I have painted cows, dozens of cows over the years. And this last year, um, I'll step out of the way for this piece. I started doing the Highland um, cattle because my kids were sending me all these TikToks. <laughs> with the Highland cows. So the, the TikToks inspired so this. The I love it. TikToks inspired this and then they ended up being so fun to paint because they have really cool hair. And so um, Kim, really quick before we go, I want to get to this because you've been able to make the hair on, on that, that cow look so real. Talk to us about the technique. You don't just oh. use brushes. What are these? Yeah, these are, um, they're actually, people sometimes will say palette knives, but these are actually painting knives. They're uh, triangulated in shape and um, it, there's just a nice flex to the steel. There's a tensile to the steel that I like, so I collect them. I have like dozens and dozens at home. Um, but when I'm painting, I'll mix my paint on the palette, and then I will pick the paint up and work um, on the surface with a knife as I'm going. So, and I also add a, a, a special wax kind of me medium, which has beeswax and resin in it to the paint. So it cures very stiff, but it adds, um, as this piece is a piece that has a lot, of, well, and that piece too by you, yeah. Jen, has a lot of texture. And I'm able to do that um, by adding that to the paint and using this to apply it. And so unfortunately we have run out of time, but the reason you should go to this art fair is because you're going to get an opportunity to talk with artists like Kim and ask them about their process. All the information for Common Ground's Birmingham Street Art Fair, you can see it right there on your screen, including ticket information and time. Thank you so much, both of you, Jeff and Kim, for joining us. We appreciate it. Thank and we'll see you next weekend at the All fair. Right.